Good evening to you from a city that has become one of Germany's most visited in recent years. We're in Leipzig. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is potentially exciting action at the quarter-final stage of the Premier Cup. It's Germany facing Manchester City. Well, a semi-final place is up for grabs, so we should be in for a classic encounter here today. With both teams desperate for silverware, I'm expecting a fiercely competitive contest, Derek. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in, and two forwards who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. Walker. Well, not the end result he had in mind. Well, we know he can hit them from that sort of range, but that was a poor effort in the end. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Jack Grealish plays with Phil Foden out wide. And handed the task of playing up front is Erling Haaland. get the corner put in by De Bruyne emphasis on the clearance a good one Leroy Zane and the ball back with City now real determination in the challenge a throw in here Nice ball. Goalkeeper's ball. The cross delivered too close to him. Tony Kroos. Raum. Dangerous looking attack. It's a perfect challenge. Holland. It's a promising city move. Grealish. Now with De Bruyne. Can he put them in front? And it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. Lohian Piaz. Oh, stylish ball. What can they do now? And the decision offside here. Gvardiol. Bernardo Silva. The ball with Rodri. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. And players waiting in the centre. Grealish. Really good build-up, but no end product. Leroy Zane. Great vision from Leroy Zane. And beyond the last defender, offside. Diesch. Akanji has it. Gvardiol. How can he take them on and beat them? He has time to play it over. And the keeper won't be complaining about that cross. Poor quality. Luciala, a very effective challenge put in. Brandt! Oh, the goal! And a moment the goalkeeper would like to 
forget all about. So City get things going again, and the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Tony Kors. Beards. And back with Kroos. Brandt. Options in the middle. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Kroos. And the flag raised. Offside it is. De Bruyne. Vardiol. Kevin De Bruyne. On to Silva. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Oh, to level the match. And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. Wonderful chance. Full marks to the keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Such a good save in the end. And De Bruyne firing it over. Well, not the best clearance. Foden. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Nicely saved. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. Leroy Zane. Beards. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. In a decent position now. Referee's whistle. That concludes the first half here at the Red Bull Arena. And the ball is moving again here, with Germany looking to build on what was a positive first-half performance. Well, they have it again. Rodri. Can he find the right pass? The ball with Rodri. Rodri. Phil Foden now. De Bruyne. Well, there is a very alert goalkeeper for you. Really getting stuck in. De Bruyne. And quick thinking defensively. Joshua Kimmich. Florian Wirtz. Brandt. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. And he's made headway. And it's gone in. Just what was needed for Manchester City, who now have squared it. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and what a good finish from Foden. He just strikes it so cleanly. It really is a well-taken goal. Kevin De Bruyne couldn't keep the ball. Making headway, Tony Kroos for the lead here. And he put it in. Well, he so badly wanted to net another one, but the keeper playing his part. Well, maybe that should have been his second, but you can see another one coming. He's playing so well here. Ederson, wonderful goalkeeping. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? He does have pressure to deal with.
Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Brandt. Could be a chance to break here. Sané. Envies. On to Brandt. Oh, surely! Oh, a tremendous reflex action there from the keeper. Well, he didn't have long to react, did he? But that's a top-class save, I have to say. And sent in by Sané. Well, just the kind of save every goalkeeper would expect to make. Walker failed to hold it. Holland Grealish on to Holland and that's how to do it inside your own penalty area can they hit on the break Brandt real chance Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And what a great finish it is. He just lifts the ball over the keeper into the back of the net. That's a well-constructed goal. Underway again with the score at 3-1. Holland, and it goes to reduce the deficit. Still very much alive and kicking. So back in action, City still behind, but this game very much a contest. Can they put it away? Oh, he's done it! But hang on, offside is the verdict here. It's not going to stand. Well, you can tell he thought he was onside here. But the assistant, I think, got it absolutely right. Kimmich. Florian Wirtz. And now here's Henrichs. Sané. And he's through here. And there's a quality defender in action. And he's gone into an illegal position, unfortunately. Ten minutes to go, then. And options in the centre. Force. Oh, is it going to be? And a goal! There he is, at the double. They just can't subdue him. Current scoreline 4 2. And he quartered the attack with a masterful tackle. Bernardo Silva. Could pull one back here. Which he does. And maybe, just maybe, there's enough time for an equaliser. It would be quite the frenetic turnaround. Well, how about this? 4-3. And we've entered the final five minutes. Florian Wirtz. Well, no point in stopping play. Advantage with them. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Now, oh, breaking at pace is always a possibility. Can they use their pace? This could square the game. Tremendous defending to stonewall him. I think the referee was spot on there. A free kick in the end after he had attempted to play advantage. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. 
Oh, he's lost possession. No possibilities in the centre. And surely, in it goes! But wait a minute, that will not count. Well, that was tight, but he was just offside. It was a good finish, though. And all over here, an acceptable outcome from a German point of view. A victory for them. Stuart, sum it up for us. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, an eye-catching performance from Julian Brandt. What did you make of what you saw from him? Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.